One thing I wish I knew then that I know now, the importance of having a systems thinking perspective. One thing that's unique about our work is, uh, particularly for social emotional learning, um, is the tendency for, er for everyone to want to grab the resources, the tools. It's kind of like a grab and go. And for our team uh, and for myself, it's, um, you know, let's, let's take a pause here. What, what are we asking? What are we asking others to do? Um, what is the experience we want our students, our teachers to have? SEL is not something that you just pick up and go. Uh, it takes time. Um, and so, um, you know, we have a, we've always held a, kind of a long-term uh, perspective. It's really kind of thinking at a more, um, at a deeper level, um, you know, and, and being more, I, I would say more trying to be our system to be more responsive as opposed to being more uh, reactive. That said, that is a, that is a perpetual challenge because um, we are conditioned to react, to turn on the fire hose of resources and tools and um, protocols. When I stepped into this work, it was thinking about the school, um, the classroom at that scale, but then um, quickly realizing that school is connected to a network. That network is now is nested within a, a, a district. If this is work that we need to do together. We cannot do this work alone. Um, and because of the complexity of our system, um, which I think is true in any district, um, this requires um, partnerships. My wife and, and kids, they both say, oh, you're, you know, you're a, you're a better husband, you're a better father. Um, and I think it's just the, the, the work has been around, um, you know, it, it is transformative work of yourself and of others. If we're asking others to do this work, uh, to invest this journey, then um, I need to do so as well. If you see yourself as an equity leader, if you see yourself as an anti-racist educator, if you, you know, if you are, um, you are about transforming um, education, then um, you have to be willing to examine yourself, your values, your beliefs, the assumptions you hold.